Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new video. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing Second Inform Vincent Abubakar. So if you do enjoy this player review and want to see more FIFA 18 player reviews on my channel, don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So if you do want to go and pick this card up, you will have to pay anywhere between 10,250 to 70,000 coins on both Xbox One and PlayStation 4. So now moving into the in-game stats, as you can see in the pace, shooting, and physical category, it has a few light greens a few dark greens and then moving over to the passing and dribbling category in the dribbling category has the orange stat of balance at 69 and then in the passing category with the crossing he has an orange stat but apart from that again they are all dark greens and light greens so guys this has been the in-game stats now let's get to the highlights so now moving into the pros and cons, the first pro I could find with the Bubakar was his strength. Now this is also his key stat of 88 strength. Now this guy is extremely strong on the ball, what's really helpful when scaling, especially you know um, for pushing off defenders and when you're in those shoulder to shoulder battles he's really good at just out strengthening the defender and then running past them. So that's a really helpful thing to have on a 5 star scaler. The next pro I could find with him was his dribbling. Now you wouldn't really think his dribbling was too good um, just from looking at his in game stats and his card stats but it's actually very very good at dribbling as you'll see from these clips he's keeping it really close to his feet and performing um, very very nice movements with the ball and then moving on to his final pro now what I could find with the boober car and that was his shooting now when I say shooting I mean this guy's finishing and this guy's long shots were also very very good again looking at the in-game stats you wouldn't really think he has the best long shots or the best finishing I think he's finishing somewhere around 83 so you know isn't really the highest but in-game just seems to finish basically everything what's really really good um, especially you know when you're playing competitively I don't really play too much competitive FIFA but if you are using this card in a competitive match such as foot champions you know you bring them on as a super sub you want to have those clinical players who can finish the chances because you know you don't really create too many chances in um, foot champs so he has high medium work rates well again it isn't too bad um, high high low probably would be better for a striker but it didn't really seem to affect his positioning too much um, he just come out of packs as a can but I'd recommend to convert this guy to the striker position he has the five star skill moves again what is really helpful does only have a three star weak foot but to be honest I found him um, to be able to finish on his both um, his right and his left foot so we didn't really find his weaker foot a problem so now moving into this next clip here we get the ball with the boober car do a nice rainbow flick flick it back over our head do a nice heel to heel there to a ball roll um, I was trying to do enough ball dribbling combo there but I think I sort of failed it but decides to carry on ring at, running at the defense do a nice running waka waka to heel to heel to a double touch spin to a body feint I go for the ball roll I go and take the shot and then his defender managed just to block it right at the end then moving into the chance here I do a nice chest flick look at that flick over the defender's head go and take the shot I thought it was going in and then it hits off the post and then for the final goal here we get a really nice free kick a scissor kick from the edge of the box into the right side of the goal so guys this has been the highlights now let's get into the overview So now moving on to the overview for Vincent Abubakar's second inform card. For a value of coins, I'm going to give him a 9 out of 5. This card goes to around 20,000 coins and you know, looking at the stats for an 84 rated inform card, I know he doesn't really play in the best league or have the best nation, but he's really good as a super sub and he's just so, so cheap for a really good card. So I'm going to give him a 9.5 out of 10 for value for coins. Enjoyment wise, I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. Competitiveness wise, I'm also going to give him an 8 out of 10. Um, I was really thinking maybe a 9 out of 10 but then I sort of thought you know some people will look at the three star week for and the work rates as a con so we decided to bring it down to an 8 out of 10. Scaling wise I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. I was so shocked about this card it was just so so good for scaling. Um, usually with his normal card I don't really find it the best for scaling just because he doesn't really have the best agility um, and his dribbling isn't the best on his normal card but you know his second inform card is actually really really good for scaling. So I'm going to give this guy an overall rating of a 9 out of 10. So guys if you have enjoyed this player review and want to see more FIFA 18 player reviews on my channel don't to leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.